Owning, owning, this beat is zoning I control their mind from straight over the phone Let them explore the words, something like a Taurus And never get addicted lest the heady wop is serious From Louis Dills to Jimmy Choo's, he's real She know the time, she sees the Richard Mille Flat double skeletal Um, I've always been a painter. I studied painting, fine art painting at art college for like 10 years. Um, you know, went through lots of different sorts of things and then just found my way of working that I felt comfortable with. Loved oil paint and then, you know, as I say, it's been a long time that I've been a painter, about 15 years. So yeah, it's just live and breathe, I love it. That's a good one to be honest with you. I've had to, I call them sneakers now, although people in England are like trainers, sneakers, what are you talking about? So no, it's definitely sneaker art because globally people know them as sneakers, so sneaker art. The later series of paintings are obviously, you know, I've just woke up and realised that half of them, or all of them basically, are like Nike SBs and Jordans. I mean, anything that catches my eye, I mean, you know, colourways or shape. I mean, things like a dunk, I, mean, I love the shape of a dunk, but more importantly, the whole Jordan series, and especially the Jordan 5, I mean, I've, I've tried to, to capture that as good as I can, you know, on about, I think I'm on to about the fifth time, and I think, I think I've just about got it locked down, to be honest with you. So no, it's anything, I mean, texture, colour, shape, it all adds up to be, you know, something that's, if it catches my eye, if it's interesting, I'll paint it. I, mean, I think so. Um, you can ask my wife, about a collection. Um, yeah, I definitely, I love sneakers, I'm a collector. Um, I only collect Nike, which is, you know, people can say you're dancing with the devil or whatever you're saying. I love Nike, I love the design. I think it's the most inspired company. I think it's the most creative company. I mean, I've just been, you know, lucky enough to do the collab tea that's dropped in Nike Asia Pacific. Um, I think they give artists like myself the opportunity to be free and creative. I mean, people like Stash Futura, you know, the kings of the game, you know, the things that they've pushed and, and put out have been, you know, phenomenal pieces of work. And it's, you know, whatever. I think they give people like myself a break to actually let loose on the creation, which is, you know, an honor, to be honest. I think about three. But my nose is getting bigger, a hundred, whatever. Um, my wife's sitting opposite me, so I'll say that many, but uh, the figure could be a little bit more. I love you. I've actually gone into production myself with my own clothing line, which is coming out in the fall in Tokyo. Which you know we're working very hard to do some nice accessories and sh um, you know things like you know classic Jordans are going to come out and things like that, and they're going to be absolutely hot. Like very limited, so you know if you want to get one, be quick really. You know I had a show in London um, a couple of years ago, and Damon Dash bought four pieces of my work, which is really nice. He just walked in and said I like those and bought them, which is cool. So you know at the end of the day, if people like what I do, it doesn't matter if you know if you're a celebrity, if you're a head. I don't care if you dig what I'm, I'm about and you actually like what I'm trying to do as a sneaker artist. I'm honoured. So you know whatever. That's a good question. I mean, to be honest with you, you know, everybody knows the game, everyone knows how it works, people queuing around stores like Babe, Supreme, whatever. I think if you start dancing with the devil and it goes pop, I think, you know, you can be very short-lived and that's not what I'm about. I'm not about, I'm not a greedy person. I'm just doing what I'm doing as an artist. I'm pushing what I'm doing as an artist. All these things like the clothing line and stuff like that is a bonus for me. It's like, most importantly, it's all about the paint and it's about me exploring sneakers. You know, I'm actually exploring, as I said before, the shape, the form, everything about them. You know, all the clothes and stuff like that, it's all, it's all a bonus, so whatever. But I'm not in it to make a lot of money out of clothing and stuff like that. They're just nice little sidelines, which, you know, giving, giving people the opportunity to have a piece.